Nathan. I'm here to present uh, my paper on six-stroke water-cooled IC engine. Uh, what is a six-stroke engine? This is uh, just a different engine from that of a conventional four-stroke engine. The four-stroke engine, what we use in day-to-day -day life, differs in, a, in some similar ways. This is a basic comparison of the four-stroke conventional engine and the six-stroke engine, what we are working on. The four-stroke engine produces uh, all these statements are theoretical statements and uh, I'm sorry we couldn't provide any technical statements about our four, six stroke engine. Uh, the power what we obtain is much higher than that of the conventional four stroke since we use two working fluids. To be very precise, uh, this is the very co construction diagram of our engine which has a blue in the injector which is shown in blue through which we introduce the or we inject the fuel for the secondary power stroke. The basic thing about our engine, to, to be very precise, it has two working cycles, it has two working fluids and it has two power strokes. So that which the power obtained is higher and the emissions are got lessened because the secondary fuel what we inject inside the engine is deionized water or distilled water commonly known as. Uh, the people in India, we all, what all we consider, we concerned about is mileage. When we get a car, we ask them what is the mileage, whatever the uh, cost of the car is. We, since we introduced a secondary fuel uh, with a primary fuel, the petrol, the mileage of your car, that is the efficiency of your car is strategically improved. Speaking about efficiency, the theoretical statement says 10% uh, of efficiency is improved when compared to that of the four-stroke engine. The, there are six working strokes in our engine which says the first three are just same as that of the conventional four-stroke engine. The first is a suction stroke, uh, the time when fuel and the air are get into the engine and the second stroke is compression. The, both the fuel and air get compressed and the third stroke, the power stroke one what we get in our engine, the fuel get combusted by a spark and, and the fourth stroke it's the recompression. What we do is, uh, in the conventional engine, the exhaust stroke, the, fuel, uh, the residual gases go out of the engine. In, in this six stroke engine, what we do is, we compress the exhaust gas, we partially send out some of the residuals and we compress, recompress it to attain some temperature inside the engine. Only then when we introduce uh, the secondary fuel that is water into the engine at the time of, at the end of recompression the water gets converted into the super saturated steam and it provides enough thrust for the piston to move downwards so that which the secondary power stroke is obtained. As the, at the end, at the same as the four stroke engine, the exhaust stroke reveals and the residual gases are sent out of the engine. Uh, we are working on a patent and we started it before six months. And now we have a patent published on this engine. I have a team of four members uh, upon which Prakash uh, is in the midst of you, is a very important person helping with me for this project, in the right in the middle of you. I'd like to, I'm proud to present you in front of you. And uh, as, a, as a boon, uh, future, what we talk about is, in future, the fuel prices doesn't get lower, it gets higher and higher. So what we have to do is contribute something to our nation and to the automotive world. This is a small step we have taken to contribute ourselves and there are many more to come. Thank you.